And analysis is a leader in portable nuclear magnetic resonance machines, MRI technology for industrial and research applications, and detection equipment services. The company just pre-released record Q4 2023 revenues, and CEO Sean Krakowski is here to provide some details and context for this update. It's Tuesday, February the 6th. I'm Martin Gagel with Market Radius Research. Please remember this is neither recommendation nor investment advice. Sean, congrats on the record quarter, as well as hitting some major milestones with your CATSA contract, which you announced last week. Please give us an overview on what's going on at analysis. Great to be here, Martin. Uh, thanks very much for the opportunity. And yeah, our team is very proud of the approximately $9.5 million uh, we did in Q4. Um, it's by far our best number ever. And we continue to um, increase our, our revenue run rate, um, demonstrating, you know, really solid growth. Um, and, and you're right, you know, one of our major projects has been this $160 million contract that we spent a lot of money and a lot of time ramping up. Um, and last week we announced that the project has been successful and now we're entering um, the more lucrative phase of the, of, the, of the project where our profitability increases. Customers very happy um, providing us with great referrals. And, and yeah, we're actually gonna grow that services side of our business substantially um, in 2024. And, and so when you combine that with our original core business of the portable MRI machines and NMR machines, which is going very well. Um, uh, 2024 is looking like a fantastic year for analysis scientific. And you're providing maintenance on the CATSA contract on uh, security equipment uh, machines. And that the synergy with that and your desktop system is that the same technicians that go and service these security equipment and detection devices, and, and then they can apply that and, and, and fix and service and maintain uh, your net, your growing network of NMR machines across the country, right? That's exactly right. You know, part of my vision has been to grow not only a global sales force, but a global service organization. And this particular contract uh, with the Canadian government was an opportunity to really scale the services business. Um, and yeah, absolutely. We want to be able to service our, our network of growing portable NMR and MRI machines, our high field NMR machines, which require preventative and corrective maintenance. Um, and this was just a great way to profitably grow a global service organization. And the last year and plus, um, a lot of the expenses have been sort of one time building out the network, getting everything set up. And now that's sort of established. And now it's call it sort of the harvesting time uh, where you get to reap the benefits of all the hard work. That's absolutely right. You know, um, um, we've spent several years. I mean, I, I first started to talk, talk to you, Martin, in May of 2019. Um, you know, since then, we've almost quintupled our revenue run rate. Um, and during that time, we've invested a lot of money. We've done a couple of acquisitions and we built something absolutely fantastic that's on a great growth trajectory. Yeah, so we're positioned very well to continue that that solid revenue growth going on into the future, um, but without um, increasing our costs. So, you know, in, in some areas we've we've flattened out our costs, um, but in other areas we've actually reduced our costs. And what's it's, what's exciting about that is our revenue is continued to going to continue to grow and grow substantially. So the the main focus of the management team and indeed our board of directors at this point in time is to get our company to sustainable prop, uh, sustainable profitability. And um, we feel like 2024 is going to be the year that we do that. And you did meant you, you've done some acquisitions in the past, or should uh, investors be expecting any more sort of uh, larger acquisitions in that coming in the future? Or is it more you're focused on executing the existing operations? No more acquisitions in the next two years. Um, we're focused in on execution and operational excellence to achieve profitability. After a couple of years, yes, there are two more acquisitions in particular that I wanna do. Um, we're keeping those relationships warm. We work on um, certain customer projects together. Um, we have great relationships with them, but um, no more acquisitions in the next two years. The services organization you've built out in Canada, is there a plan or an opportunity to expand that out south of the border and, and sort of run that same kind of model profitably uh, in the U.S.? Absolutely. Um, 
Canada is a great market for us, but um, the United States and Europe are, are better markets and, and we'll be growing that services business into the United States and the developed world. With your announcement, you you besides the services business going well, you announced that you shipped and sold 14 of your 100 megahertz uh, units in the fourth quarter. That business sounds like it's doing well. It's picking up. Yeah, absolutely. You know, our our um, our core technology business is these um, portable MRI machines, or to be more particular, portable NMR spectrometers. Um, and, you know, we had some operational challenges a year ago, but very proud to say that we fixed those. We had a great fourth quarter and we see that continuing. You know, we continue to innovate on the technology side. And yes, we're building out services business that goes hand in hand, um, but we're still uh, innovating with, with our technology. Very proud to say that we were recently granted the United States patent on a, on a particular area of the technology that's associated with our 100 megahertz. So we'll always be an innovation company and we'll always be about portable magnetic resonance machines. That's great news. Any final words before we wrap things up here? Um, I look forward to future opportunities to talk with you, Martin. We've got an exciting uh, pipeline of catalysts um, that are gonna demonstrate that our business is going in the right direction um, and an exciting future for shareholders. Excellent. Sean, thank you very much for joining us and talk to you again soon. My pleasure. Thank you.